Hello. I'm Karen from Virginia. I live in Southern Virginia. And I am doing a video response to Sybil's birthday challenge. Happy 52, Sybil. Uh, I myself just turned 53 last week, so I'm right there with you, girl. Best years of my life. I want to get right to it. And I want to share with you my five love of my life. Number one. Uh, we all love our family, of course, and but I have two grandbabies. I have a two-year-old girl named Brianna and a one-month-old boy named Nathan. And they are the love of my life. Love them, love them. They just make this 53-year-old feel 25 again. I love them. Number two is cooking. I love to cook. And I love to take it to people. Um, I have some elderly friends that I share with. My neighbors, my family, my co-workers. Whoever will eat my cooking, I will take it. And I just love to cook. And I love to eat it. Yay! Number three is the beach. I love the beach. I was born at the beach at Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. And I just love, it makes me feel close to God. Hearing the waves, watching the sun come up, having the sand and the water, and no matter how you're feeling, you know what? Nobody can change the Lord being in control. The waves coming in and the waves going out. It's just so soothing to me. And number four, I love playing cards. We play cards quite a bit. We play with my parents, who are 77 years old, and we play Canasta, which is a very, very challenging game. And I'm so proud that my parents can still play and have their good minds and are just fun people to be with. And then we play Rook with another couple friend of ours, and then we play um, Spades with a different couple. So depending on who we're with is what game we play. And so, and they even have Monopoly on cards. I love playing that too. So, uh, cards. Um, number five is Christmas. I love Christmas. I've always had good Christmases, but my very best Christmas was in 2005. I had spent a year in the hospital. I had cancer. I had my jaw removed, and they cut me from here to here, and they put a bone from my leg in my jaw. Well, right, I got out of the hospital on December 22nd with my last chemo. And so Christmas Eve, we celebrate at my mom's every year. And my husband was walking around, and he was like, well, if I asked you to marry me again, would you? I was like, do you have a ring? He was like, yes, I do. I was like, oh. And so he gave me this beautiful ring. Just beautiful, beautiful. And um, he asked me to marry him again. And that was my favorite Christmas ever. I was just happy to be alive. God had been so good to us that year, and a lot of good things happened. Even though I had chemo and treatments and surgery, it just was a great, great time. Um, now, for my other two things, my favorite, I have two YouTube channels that I go to quite a bit. Uh, I am a mixed media artist, and Cassandra Cushman, and I will put her link um, in this part. She's a good friend of mine now. She was the very first one to invite me to be on a designer team. And um, since then, we've both grown a lot in our art. And we do a lot of mixed media. And I love watching her videos of how she creates. And then my second one is a card lady. Her name is Dawn's Stamping Thoughts. And I'll put her link here. She does a lot of Stampin' Up stuff. And I, do, I love Stampin' Up. And so I do a lot of her techniques and um, copy her uh, inspiration cards. And she, I can always get a good idea from Dawn. So those are my favorites. And the last thing is, what am I looking forward to? Well, every year it's become a tradition that me and my husband go on vacation with my son and his family. And so it's in September. So that's what I'm looking forward to. This year, Nathan will be like nine months old. Brianna will be almost... Three. It will be so much fun. Last year was fun teaching her how to swim and seeing her in the waves and she just would fall down, let the waves just run over her. It was just so awesome. 
And so I cannot wait till this year. So until next year, Sybil, I hope you have a very happy birthday. And I, I love you. Thanks for this challenge. It was great. See ya.